guys welcome back to another youtube video my name is lauren if you're new it's saturday it's already been an eventful saturday i woke up really early still can't sleep in by the way i did just start my new job this past week so i just finished up my first week sorry christian's texting me um I did just finish up my first week at my new job and so far it's incredible. It's everything that I could ask for and more. I have obviously only been in the training process so it, my brain literally felt like mush for the first few days and um, it was just a lot of information all at once so I just I felt really tired. I've It's worn me out. I mean training for a new job and just like getting all that new information, trying to figure things out. Um, it's a lot, but wouldn't trade it. I am really excited about this opportunity and this job and the people that I get to work with. Everyone there is so incredible and just so nice. So I'm really excited. So I did want to fill you guys in on that. I took last weekend off of YouTube. You probably can't tell because one weekend I filmed literally so many videos. So got me really far ahead so I didn't I haven't missed a week of uploading because of that which is really really good so I can take time off without having a video not go up if that makes sense but anyways yeah so my new job is just going great I'm really excited for it and um, also I have been like working on a YouTube video that I've want that I want to post in the next few days probably Monday and I've been working on it all week, obviously putting in like extra hours. I've been like staying up late to like edit the video all while like getting into a new job position and just being really like tired and <laughs> my brain is just like filled with all this like new information and I'm trying to edit and stuff. And then um, all of my files or my video files for the video became corrupted and now I have to start from scratch with the video just kind of sucks when stuff like that happens so I've I obviously still have all the footage I save it to an external hard drive before I like get into editing it so right when I upload it I always put it on an external hard drive so it's safe and I have the footage and that way I can get it off this camera and stuff like that but that was just kind of frustrating when stuff like that happens because obviously I put in like a lot of time and work and effort like after <laughs> my job so it just it's kind of it kind of sucks but anyways it is also christian and i's four year anniversary and i can't believe it's been this long it's crazy i can't believe it's been four years i mean it's been the best four years ever um the relationship that i have with christian is the happiest and healthiest relationship that i've ever been in and i wouldn't trade it for the world and i just can't believe it's already been four years i literally love him so much and um i'm just so excited to celebrate four years and um we're not doing anything tonight we're probably just actually i know for sure we're not doing anything tonight we're just going to be cooking some steaks at home with some sides we'll just hang out and stuff like that anyways um yeah so yeah i don't really have anything planned today other than it's our four year anniversary we're probably just gonna chill i yeah, there's nothing that we're doing that I have planned. But, um, let me like, <laughs> I really wanna make another coffee. I ran out of beans. Let me figure out where to put you. This is probably gonna be terrible lighting. Um, I ran out of coffee beans this past week, and it was tragic. So I've been drinking the La Colombe cold brew, and I love it. I don't know where to put you. Sorry, Christian's at the grocery store getting some stuff for dinner tonight, but um, and he's also picking us up some like sandwiches or wraps for lunch. But I ran out of coffee beans, and it's always really tragic when I do that because I try my best to plan accordingly and not go through the beans too fast. But we have people in town, so I didn't plan to, you know what I mean? And I like all my beans to be fresh because they brew the best out of this machine, fresh. But I picked up this La Colombe cold brew for the meantime for the mornings and it's really good. I actually want to try their beans next. So I just got the blue bottle beans that I usually get. 
I went back to the Giant Steps blend. The last blend that I got just wasn't it. It was called the Beta Blend. I just, I didn't like it. But, um, so I went back to the Giant Steps, which is my favorite. And I think I'm going to try La Cologne beans next because they do a subscription service. And I believe their beans are cheaper than the Blue Bottle beans. I'm going to make a coffee or a cold brew. Christian just got home from the grocery store. He was there for like an hour and a half. He got me some flowers and then he got some stuff to make lunch. So we're gonna, well, he is actually making a chicken pita. We also just got the always pan and we've used it the past few nights. So far we like it. I think it cleans really well. It's super non-stick. So I know that when I posted the caraway pan video, someone asked me what the difference was and I have never even tried the always pan. So we just got one and we got it in black, but so far we love it. So I'll keep you updated on that. This is some of the stuff that he got from the store. Kind of want some of this with some carrots right now. This hummus is so good. The Buffalo Ranch one, it's really good. Here we go, tzatziki. First thing you're gonna do. Boom, boom, boom. Tomato. Little, which one of these? Yeah. A little bit of onion. Chicken. Oh, the, chicken. the chicken looks so good. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of lettuce. A little bit of lettuce and then parsley. Wrap it up. I wish we had like a press. There you go. That would be great. It's a press. Mm -hmm. Good? So good? No, it's so good. I'm also reintroducing dairy back in to see how I feel. No, babe, this is so good. I might want a second one. Yeah, we, we might have enough for another for sure. I love you. a little Sephora haul. I went to Sephora for one thing and I came out with two things. <laughs> Should have just done the pickup but I was kind of browsing. So first thing I went for was the Inculist Oat Cleansing Balm. Sorry it's like really bright. The lighting is not good. This is the best cleansing balm and you can also use it as a mask. For 10 minutes you can leave on for a nourishing face mask. I've personally never used it as a face mask, but it's really good at removing your makeup. I double cleanse. I use this to remove my makeup and then I wash my face as well. I also got the Laneige Lip Glowy Balm. I've never tried the, I've obviously tried the lip sleeping mask, but I've never tried the lip balm. And I got it in the gummy bear flavor. Because it sounded like, I don't know. <laughs> it sounded tasty. So I'm gonna try it. Oh, it's purple. It smells like a gummy bear. I like it. I just wanted something like on the go. I do love the, I, I do love the Summer Fridays lip butter balm. It's literally my favorite. Sorry, I'm like pressing buttons. Um, it's my favorite, but yeah, that's my little Sephora haul.
I'll link the products. This one's really good. It tastes really good, but this, I can't even tell you how many times I've repurchased the oat cleansing balm. It's literally my favorite thing ever. So, Whole Foods is in the same parking lot as Sephora. Sephora's over there. And it sucked me in, and I got a ton of stuff. I'll show you when I get home, but <laughs> I was driving by and I was like, you know what, I could go in. Okay, just got home from Whole Foods and Sephora. I'm gonna do a little haul. I was just making a TikTok. I don't know if it's gonna turn out good or not, but I'll show you what I got. I picked up more oat milk. I love the Elmhurst brand because this one has some sugar in it, but the milk, oat milk is still really good. I like the milk almond milk better than the oat milk, but I'm like switching up my milk. So I'm switching back to oat milk. I've been really obsessed with oat milk lately. So I wanted to switch it up. I love, this is my favorite one, but they were out. Got some apple cider vinegar dressing. This is really good. Got these dill pickles. Thought these would be so good. Are you trying to come up with a saying to say to Maya in Serbian? Misio sem de polica. Um, my friend Maya is Serbian and Christian's voice messaging her. Um, dill pickles. I got some sweet. <laughs> I got some Sweet Lauren's um, chocolate chip cookies to have for dessert tonight after dinner. I got some more of these taco seasoning packets by Siete. These are really good and they were on sale at Whole Foods. So I saw them on an end cap and picked them up. I got some peanut butter filled pretzels. I thought we could try these and see if they're any better than the um trader joe's ones i got some plantain chips these were on sale too and i saw them on an end cap they always get me on the end caps salt and vinegar and lime i got these sun poppers the sour cream and onion ones these are so good and then two ginger lime poppies i love these and i love this flavor they were on an end cap and they got me <laughs> okay so i'm gonna put this stuff away Okay, we're about to start cooking dinner, but we're gonna make some margaritas. I know they don't really go with steak, but whatever, it'd be fun. And we're gonna try this. Christian sells this. It's new. It's it's gonna be hard to find. When do you think it will hit stores? It's, it's out, but it's- It's out, it's, it's just good. hard to find. You can order it online. It's a margarita mix. So it's basically everything you need in this. And um, it's like low sugar, good ingredients, right? Yeah, it's probably one of the best and probably one of the healthier options that you can buy. So I'll link the website down below. I'll also let you know how it is. And this is the tequila that we're gonna use. I've never tried this tequila. And then we're gonna do a tahini rim and then a bunch of lime. I'm gonna make a, a TikTok. <laughs> I'm setting up, <laughs> gonna try and make one, so. Okay, we just finished making the, Christian help me with my <laughs> TikTok. Um, but we just finished making it. We haven't even tried it yet because I needed to film and take some photos, but let's try it together. Do you lick it and then? Yeah. These taste really good. So good. Okay, now we're gonna start cooking dinner. Um, we're gonna cook steaks, pasta, and then we're gonna make a salad to go with it. And then we're gonna drink some margaritas with it. All right, honey. Ooh. This smells a little bit more limey. Than the other one? Mm-hmm. Which I don't like. I like, I think I like less than All right. This is the stirring margarita mix as opposed to the filthy. I'll try this. You don't like it as much? No, it's good. What's the difference in the... It's more, it's more limey. Oh, it is. It's far more limey. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Not bad, though. Making the salad right now. Let's go with that. I'm just cutting up some peppers, some little sweet peppers. So I just made the bowl. 
Um, okay. ro yeah, you can go ahead. Romaine, like a 50-50 mix. Red onion, tomato, cucumber, red and orange. Sweet love peppers. Then some black pepper and then fresh grated Parmesan cheese on top. Day. I went and got coffee this morning at this place called Lineage in East End Market, which is like Winter Park area. And then I came back and now I'm gonna go to the mall and return a shirt and maybe like shop around, browse around for a little bit. I think I wanna go into Zara and yeah, just have a little day. Drinking the gingerade poppy that I got yesterday. I got a few of them at Whole Foods and it's so good. It's like a ginger ale. So let's go do that. I'm doing laundry. I want to wash my bed sheets today. Let's just get, I mean it's Sunday. I just want to get ready for the work week. So yeah, but let's go to the mall, return the shirt, browse around and then come back do laundry. Okay, I'm not gonna try both on. I also put stuff in the dryer, but I um, wanted to show you what I got from the mall today. And so I had to go into Cotton On and return a tank top. And while I was in there, I picked up two more tank tops and they were 50% off each of them. So I ended up getting two for the price of one. So that's why I got two colors, but I got the first one um, in this green color. I didn't get these shorts. This is the outfit that I was wearing before. It just looks like that. Super cute and I got it in this brown color as well. <laughs> this doesn't really help. I can link it down below. It's like the perfect tank top for summer. I still have to remove some of the tags, but um, I think it's a bra actually. I think that's how they broadcast it, but it's a long line. So you could totally wear it as a bralette or wear it as a top with some high-waisted shorts. This is the set that I was wearing to the mall today. It's from um, Target. I just have it tucked up. This is what it looks like without it tucked up. So I tuck it up into my bra and I thought it was so cute. So it's from Target, I can link it. I actually saw it on TikTok and I ordered the tan color <laughs> of it as well. But really cute, nice green color. I know it's starting to get into spring and summer, but this is just something comfy to throw on, hang out, you know. And next what I got, so I just got those two tank tops and then I got this green dress from Zara and it's kind of long here. Let me, it hits me kind of long, but for like I'm 5'2", so it hits me at my shin. Thought it'd be super cute for like dinner during the summertime with maybe like some white sneakers or could wear sandals. I'm going on a trip this summer, so I wanted to pick it up because I thought it would be perfect to throw on and go to dinner in. So what size did I get it in? I got it in a small, it's like 25 bucks. Here's the tag if you want to screenshot it. I don't know why it looks so close, but that's all I got from the the mall. I'm doing some laundry now. I need to go, I think, to Publix. I need to get some lemons and maybe some fruit. And that's it. We basically have everything for the week from the grocery store. I'm just going to do some laundry, hang out. I think I'm going to post a YouTube video today. And that's about it. 
but I'll link everything that I got at the mall down below just in case you're interested I'll also link this set it's cute so. I went and picked up hummus house for dinner. If you have a hummus house close to you, I get the brown rice with spinach, tabbouleh, chickpeas, tomatoes, cucumber. I asked for the onions and the peppers grilled, so grilled onions and peppers, and then just guacamole hummus, and it's so good. Usually I eat half of it for dinner, and then the other half I'll have for lunch tomorrow. <laughs> 